Hi, right, it's time for another math. Easy solution. We're going to discuss well, counting in binaries. I want to go over a quick tutorial on what a binary is and then basically how to count it and what it's uh, what those numbers are equivalent to in the regular base 10 is what we were accustomed to. I just want to go over this base 10 versus base 2 quickly. So what I mean by base 10 is this is the regular number system we're used to if I count from 0 to 9. Yeah, so yeah, I counted here from 0, 1, 2, 3, all the way to 9 here. These are 10 uh, numbers right here. So 10... So basically base 10 is we count 10 numbers and then we increase to the next uh, two digits here. So this is equals to two, uh, one digit and then we increase to two digits. So we're going to get a 10 right here and this is two digits and then we continue on the same thing. We're going to get 11. So all we do is increase this this uh, uh, yeah, this yeah last decimal place here. So or, um, this last uh, digit here. So one, 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 two, et cetera, all the way till one, nine. <clears throat> and then we increase. Now, what, now with this one, we're going to have 10 numbers in here. Yeah, we'll have 10 numbers. I just uh, erased that and just wrote down this here a bit neater. So then we're going to get 10, 11, 12, all the way to 9. Number every single time, there's going to be 10 digits until we increment the, the next decimal place here. I mean, uh, the next uh, digit here. So now we're going to get to 19. Then we increase to 2. And then we keep doing this and we increase to whatever this number is. So this was going to be 3. So we're going to get to 30, etc. Then 40, then 50 all the way up to 90 and then the exact same thing we're going to get from here we're going to get to 99 and then we increase all the digits we're going to get to 100 and we start we repeat this whole process and then we get 200 etc then we get to 1000 etc so this is base 10 is what we're used to now this exact same thing uh, if with base 2 or base or any kind of base but then we only look at the first two digits here for base 2 here so we only look at these 0 and 1 here and we increment exactly how we did above here so we go to let's say base 2 yes yeah, so base 2 we only go from 0 to 1 so then this is two numbers here. So yeah, this base two is, is binary. So we get two numbers here and then we increase the digits. This is one digit in each uh, one here. And then we increase the exact same way, but since there's only zero and one, we go from zero to one, then we go directly to this point right here. So we're gonna get now a 10. And then the next one's gonna be 11 here. So again, two digits and then until we have to increase uh, this side right here. since. There is no two, three, four, five, etc. We go directly to the third. We're gonna go directly to one zero zero here. So then this is gonna be like that. One zero one. This is two, and then we increase now again the center one. So we're gonna get at one one zero, and then one one one. So this is two as well. And then we go to the next one. It's gonna be one zero 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 or a thousand, and then we increase it again one zero one. And this is two, and then we increase the next one. We keep doing this one uh, twice, and then we increase this, etc., until we get. Uh, then we are going to get one zero 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 so a thousand or ten thousand here. Or uh, I think that's yes, yeah, so one less zero. Okay, so ten thousand. Yeah. Now to basically illustrate binary a bit further, I just want to go through a, a pretty uh, useful example, uh, basically on counting binary. Basically, if one one zero one is in binary. What would be the equivalent number in the regular base 10 counting system? Or what I mean, what I mean by this is just count it. So if this one, uh, let's say this is going to be 0, 1, just 2, 3. So we're basically counting in regular systems. 4, 5 here, 6, 7, etc. here. So for 7 in, in, in regular system, it's just going to be 1, 1, 1 in binary. So now, basically, what is uh, 1, 1, 0, 1? Well, uh, you could either you could just count this and see what you get, or what you could do um, is basically let's just compare first what it, the regular to how how we count regular base ten here. Yeah, and basically to uh, illustrate this a bit further, before I get to this, I want to look at a base ten counting system. Let's say three forty one here, and let's say this is base ten, and then to see how do we count this one. Well, well, what we actually do is we break this up. We could break this up into three hundred plus forty plus one here. So as you can see here in this one, this is this is a three times a hundred. And this one right here, we're adding a plus four times a ten. And this one here is just a plus a one. Or what you could do is plus one times it by let's just make it something look like this. Let's say yeah, one one times it by one here. I'll, I'll show what, show what I mean because we're we're moving a zero here. We want to remove this one. We're going to get this one. And you could also write this as three times. 10 to the 2, that's just 100, plus 4 times 10 to the 1 here, that's a 10, plus 1 times 
10 to the 0 here. So as you can see the, the pattern here, so basically whatever the digit is, is just going to be multiplied by 10 to the whatever. But in the base 2, we do exactly the same thing, except we multiply now but with, with 2 to the power of. So then to answer this one based on exactly how we did a buffer base 10, so 1101, this can be broken down into basically this equals to now this one right here, this 1 times it by 2 to the 0, 1, 2. No, I mean 3 here. It's just going to be 0, 1, 2, 3. So 3 plus 1 times 2 to the 2 right here, plus 0 times 2 to the 1, and then plus 1 is the last one times it by uh, 2 to the 0 here. So it's just 2 to the 0 is just going to be 1. So we're going to have equals to this 2 to 3 is going to be 8 plus 4 plus now this one's going to be 2 plus 1 here. So in, in regular counting, we're going to get now it's going to be 6, 7. So we're going to have 15 right here. So this is the, this is the equivalent number of it. So 15 in base, uh, this one's base 10 right here. And also, uh, if you want to, let's just say, so let's look at one that we know the number of exactly. So we know that 111 is 7 just by counting. We got 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 111 is 7. Let's just see if we can get it exactly the same way. So 111, we do exactly the same thing. We're going to get 1, the far 1 times 0, 1, 2, times the 2 to the, this one's going to be 2 to the 3. I mean 2 to the 2 here, 0, yeah, 0, 1, 2 plus 1 times 2 to the 1 plus 1 times 2 to the 0 right here. So we're going to get equals to 4 plus 2. This one's going to be 2 plus a 1 here. So this equals to 7. So as you, as you can see, this one is correct from above. Are. Yeah, so yeah, that's uh, all I wanted to get through today. Uh, hopefully uh, you learned from uh, these little examples on this one here, how to count in binary uh, and also how what's equivalent base 10 or just basically counting it. Well, that's all for today. Remember, you can uh, download these notes in the Dropbox link below if you learn, and uh, stay tuned for another math easy.